In this video I will present 5 cars which prove to be affordable and sporty at the same time. So here we go. At number 5 we have Suzuki Swift Sport. This car isn't too spectacular but for someone looking for a newer car with a sporty sound, with features, a low fuel consumption and a decent acceleration, jackpot. We have a 1.6 naturally aspirated petrol engine with 136 horsepower and 160 Nm of torque which make the car accelerate from 0 to 100 km per hour in just 8.2 seconds. Not that fancy, but it's decent. The wheels look great, the car looks great overall and you can find one which is almost new at around 9000 euros. I found it a great deal, so you should get one. Next at number 4 we have the BMW 1 Series 120i, which again, it isn't too spectacular, but it can be a great pick if you're looking for a practical car with sport capabilities. It accelerates from 0 to 100 km per hour in 7.8 seconds. It has a 2 liter naturally aspirated inline 4 engine which produces 170 horsepower and 210 Nm of torque. The engine has direct injection and a high compression ratio, so expect to have a great fuel economy as well. Add the limited slip differential for more fun and you can start drifting this car like a champ. It's reliable, fuel efficient, the transmissions are awesome both manual and automatic and you have anything you want from it. Plus the engine is naturally aspirated and nowadays it's pretty hard to find one. So you should be getting this car if you love BMW and you want a practical and decent car with sport capabilities. Next at number 3 we have the Mazda 3 MPS which has a 2.3 turbocharged gas engine. This car can be easily tuned by adding a stage 1 software but I wouldn't add more power to this car because it's front wheel drive and after 250 horsepower it's pretty dangerous to drive when you floor it. Handling is compromised. To put all that power down and to control the car properly you would need a rear wheel drive or all wheel drive. So don't. Its stock power is more than enough. It accelerates from 0 to 100 km per hour in just 6.1 seconds and you can find one in decent condition at around 9000 euros. At number 2 we have a great deal, you can find a great sports car at a low price, we have the Volkswagen Golf 5 GTI. It has a 2 liter turbocharged gasoline engine which produces 200 horsepower and 280 Nm of torque. This engine is well known for its tuning capabilities, so you can easily add a stage 1 or a stage 2 software. 0 to 100 km per hour in 7.2 seconds and if you add a stage 1 to increase power from 200 to 240 horsepower and torque from 280 to 350 Nm of torque, you will improve acceleration to around 6.5 seconds. That will cost you around $400 to do, so it's pretty affordable. At just 7000 euros, the GTI is an excellent sports car with lots of capabilities. It can be practical, it can be more aggressive, it can be easily tuned, so it's a great pick. And finally, at number 1 we have the Audi TT. It shares the same engine as the Golf GTI, the 2 liter turbocharged gas engine, which has 200 horsepower. In my opinion the TT is the sportiest of all, it has a lower center of gravity and a lower height compared to all the other cars we talked about earlier and I find it really good looking. The boot is friendly enough to carry luggage for two people if you want to go on a longer journey and you can add some more horses by adding a stage 1 chip as we talked earlier for the Golf GTI. And after all, let's face it, it's an Audi, it's luxurious, you have plenty of features and the car looks wicked. You can find one in excellent condition at around 9 to 10 thousand euros. Add a few thousand euros and you can pick the Audi TT with a 3.2 VR6 engine and quattro all wheel drive. So let me know in the comment section what other cars you have in mind at a decent price and as always thank you for watching, subscribe for more car videos and I'll talk to you guys in the next one.